I love dance. Ever since I was small, I started ballet when I was four years old and you can ask my friends in high school, they would say I used to be dancing up and down the halls all the time. <laughs> it was a good stress relief, good exercise, um, good way to meet people. I met my boyfriend through dancing, ballet, jazz, modern, salsa, hip-hop, uh, tango, yeah, and just different things. I love them all. Uh, September 2010. I was 28 years old. And, um, as soon as I got back, I got back the Saturday and the Monday the doctor called me in and said you need to come in as soon as possible. Uh, we have to tell you some things. So that's when I found out. Seeing Crystal go through what she went through was, was tough. Um, I was in the room when she got the call. Nobody in my family had breast cancer that I know of. And when I found out, I, was, I wasn't even sure what it meant. I thought, okay, it's just a small lump. Like, you just remove it and that's it, right? Because of her, I got to use dance. And I got to give dance a purpose. Um, to me, hope is a chance, a possibility, an opportunity. Because of hope, I get to dance with my friend again. That one of my biggest supports was uh, just the other young woman going through breast cancer as well. Um, you know, just having somebody there going through the same thing and being able to talk to them. And, I mean, Rethink was one of those organizations that they brought us together. Well, you know, I'm just happy to be here, happy to be alive <laughs> and to be feeling healthy again and have my strength again. I sit behind a desk all day, but the dancing helps me to just release and be somebody else. Knowing that I am well and I have so much to look forward to. So you're cancer-free? I would say so right now, yes. <laughs> cancer-free. I definitely want there to be a cure. Like I've seen too many other young women go through this and how hard it's been for them and their families and you know, I just don't want to see that anymore. And that's why I've been trying to give so much of myself as well to, to help the cause in any way I can. Float on August 25th, 2012 and support a future without breast cancer.